Okay, so we, we've now joined Cycle Track 43 from Anastawi to Astavera. That's where I'm off today. Morning. Not so bad, you okay? Yeah, right Just passing through, guys. Thank you. Right. Yeah, not so bad, you okay? Bad, lovely, you. lovely day, isn't it? So today's bike ride is around 20, 21 miles. Come on in, just passing through. Thank you. Uh, and from the start of the cycle track, we can take off about two and a half, three miles. So, all in all, a good 17 miles on the cycle track. It's a very easy cycle track, plenty of room. Most of it is well tarmacked. And the scenery is absolutely stunning. Okay, enjoy the ride. <clears throat> so I'm filming this today on my GoPro Hero 8 Black and yesterday the Hero 9 Black was announced so I shall be potentially looking to trade in and upgrade because the camera looks amazing um, I'm on the activity mode today and I find uh, with that mode you get more of a, a panoramic view. Morning. colours today are absolutely stunning absolutely stunning so if you take a right here you're going to end up in Gleis if you take a left you end up in Kirach which is where I'm heading now Just got the the Mond factory coming up on your right hand side and we'll be crossing the river and following up the canal to Ponte Dowie. Gorgeous 
gorgeous day today. It's uh, about nine o'clock. It's going to be a, a hot one. It's uh, Thursday, September the 17th, I think. So the, the cycle track by here, just about two or three hundred yards. It's not too narrow. Still plenty of room for passing, keeping your distance. Talking to the guys in the Swansea Canal Society and they were looking to, or they are looking to dredge this part of the canal over the next two and a bit years as they're celebrating the 225th anniversary of the canal so that would be absolutely amazing there's about a dozen people that work in a canal so if you want to volunteer the offices are in front of me in about six to eight hundred yards. Morning. Ah, uh, thank you. Cheers. So you've got the lower Clivach lock and on the right was where my mother was born. Just passing through. Thank you. Morning. Morning. Just passing through. Don't rush, don't rush. <laughs> Lord, gosh, thank you. So this canal has been dredged. Uh, looks absolutely beautiful. I'm not sure what they're going to do on the left hand side by here. But it would be good just to see the canal back to how it looked many years ago. Another stunning part of the canal and this tunnel coming up has caught me several times where I've nearly fallen off so I tend to dismount here and just walking through. Morning! Just coming through. Ah, thank you. Lovely day. Ah, gorgeous. So this is it, like I said I tend to dismount, although today <laughs> I've gone through <laughs> and watch that pipe above because if you stick your head up you're going to chop it off. So 
so the leaves are falling it's uh, a beautiful autumn, autumn day this part of the canal where they've dredged at the steepest about four foot and I never get bored of coming up here wonderful wonderful part of the cycle track and a fantastic job done by the Canal Society so on your right you've got the Mond Golf Club uh, it's a cracking course done it a couple of times Hiya. This is uh, one of the few parts of the cycle track that hasn't yet been tarmac, but it's really nice and flat, no bumps, very smooth. Just to the right you've got the River Tawi, which is, uh, I don't know, about 40 feet below where we are. Ah, uh, thank you. Okay. I'll be, I'll be nice and slow, don't worry. Yeah, it's a Okay. okay. <laughs> Hello, boy. Hello. Hello. The leaves are starting to fall off the trees now and it's uh, absolutely beautiful, beautiful colours. Or as my wife would say, beautiful, it's beautiful. I think... Uh, in the next week or so, the colours are going to be absolutely amazing. Thank you, they're pretty good now. Mm. So you've got some uh, riding stables. On um, the right hand side, and we will shortly be coming into Tribanos. So you've got Tribanos lower lock. On the left hand side. And if you want to join the cycle track, just to my left, you can park your car. So you've got the Cabanas upper lock right here.
and this part of the track has been tarmacked in the last month and they've, they've done a cracking job. Morning. Now, if you carry straight on, you're going to end up in Point of Dowie. So, just take a right by here, and the cycle track will continue, but this time you'll be following the River Towie all the way up to La Silvera. Uh, after that then, I think you have to get on the road for maybe a mile and then it joins the cycle track all the way up to Abercrave so I'll be doing that in the next few weeks Thank you. Okay. River's looking absolutely beautiful today. I think the trout fishing season finished, but the salmon the sewing fishing season goes to I think it's early October. Pull in. Pull in. Morning. Oh, thank you. Thank you. On your left, it's going to be Ponte Dowie Inn. It's coming up. Oh, there's a lovely smell of food whenever I pass here. Not quite there yet, but uh, shortly on my left hand side. Go. 
Don't you mark these outside? And very shortly, you're going to be leaving the cycle track only for about 600 yards. Um, it's a quiet industrial estate. It's hardly ever much traffic on on you. And if you want to ride on a pavement, then uh, you can do that. So we got uh, four miles to Estavera. Just rejoin the pavement for here and we'll rejoin the cycle track in a minute. There we go. Okay. This next uh, part of the cycle track is my favourite. Absolutely breathtaking scenery, beautiful location. And if you want to join the cycle track, you can just park your car back there, 50 yards, and enjoy this. Coming up on the right hand side you're going to have a, a small footbridge which you will need to take to carry straight on you'll come to a dead end about half a mile. Cheers. Thank you. So this is the bridge I need to go across. Usually there's no one here, but there is. I just tend to let them cross the bridge and then I'll follow through.
So, if you take a right, you're going to end up in Ashtwen on the main road, you know, 100 yards, so make sure you take a left. Lovely long stretch coming up now. So as many of you will know, I've had my own photography business for many, many years. Not doing so much these days. Just concentrating on lifestyle, model shoots, landscapes, nature, and macro. But uh, there are some cracking locations coming up waterfalls, small tributaries, uh, on the left you've got the river, so I'm sure I'll end up doing a few shoots up here. This is one of my favourite locations for here. I think it must have been part of uh, Copperopolis a few hundred years ago. Uh, some great uh, locations, great locations for Fort Shoot there. Who are dogs will be shattered? <laughs> Another beautiful long straight and I'll be stopping on the left hand side in a minute just to show you some scenes from the river. You don't really notice it, but on the way up the Swansea Valley, there's a, it's a bit of a slight incline all the way up, but you, do, you don't really notice it. But coming back, you really notice that everything is downhill a little bit. So I find it a lot easier coming back than I do going up, although there's no energy, really. It's a beautiful sight. Lovely path. <coughs> Morning. Morning. Lovely day. I'm surprised there aren't many people around today. Mind you, it's uh, Thursday, so I guess it'll get uh, busier this weekend. Another wonderful weekend of weather coming up. So, to the left is, just I'm gonna stop for a minute and show you the River Towie.
Whew. There's a heron taking off there. And that's the view up the Swansea Valley. Stunning. Absolutely stunning. This place in the winter time when the storms have come through. This breath taken. Okay, let's get back on the bike. Mm. Uh -oh. I just put up my lycra shorts before they fall down here. Yeah? Not a pretty sight. Right. In the waterfall on the right hand side there, gonna have a look at that one day. It's gonna make for a crack in the photo shoot. So this uh, run for me today would be a fraction over 20 miles and I try and do four of these per week. Sunlight, a bit chilly in the uh, shade. I wish I'd brought the uh, something a bit thick on. Hey, it's a bit windy too. Here we go, a bit of sunshine. So we're coming up uh, to the memorial where tragically four miners lost their lives nine years ago uh, the anniversary was a couple of days ago uh, very tragic so we'll just stop and pay our respects So we're at uh, Dodger Grave now, and uh, just stop off for uh, two minutes.
well the wind's against me so I do still have the wind behind me on the way back home morning Nine miles in today, so not far now, another 10 minutes and we'll be heading back. That's a lovely, lovely sight on the right hand side for photo shoot. I'm not sure where this bridge comes out. Uh, oh, I know, it's uh, the estate in Dodger Great, you know. Great location we're here, lovely rock formations, great forward shoot, water coming down, definitely one to investigate, fabulous. Again, all the cliffs, cliff face for here, the weather should be stunning in the winter with the icicles.
warm in the sunshine now, it's lovely. I'll go, I'll go nice and slow. Uh, thank you. Morning. And here we are at the end of Cycle Route 43, although it does carry on, but you've just got to join the road by the Asda roundabout in the Slavera. And as you can see, cycle track is straight ahead, or signpost is straight ahead. So, uh, 